This one is uh, Mooping. She's cooking up here. We're just at our local market. And this one in particular is my favorite. This is the extra spicy one. Isan, Isan sauce. Isan sauce. Yeah, Mooping, a lot, man. There you go. It's so, it's so yummy. It's like very, very spicy, and Ryan, he like it. Spicy, but not too bad. Not Thai spicy. Like usually, it's just you can't handle it. The longer you live here, guys, the more easy it is to eat spicy food. When you first get it, you're like, oh no, but then it, it kind of grows on you. Before Ryan, he cannot eat spicy, and now it's like, uh, for me, when I eat this, it's like very spicy, right? But he can't take it, so he very good now. Like in Thailand, many, many years already. Damo just ordered Sip Mai, which is Sip Wood, 10 Wood. Um, mai, you have Mai, Mai. My, 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 like this. So you have four, diff five different tones there of, um, which I've probably murdered, of the my sound. We've actually come to the market today to get some cheap clothes for the kids. We always come here for shopping clothes because it's cheap. Yeah, and you you see the size for Hugo. Sometimes when we order online in the wrong size, you know. So this one is good for him. 50 baht, one uh, quid. Um, one quid, can you say that babe? One quid. One quid. Do you know what one quid means? Money. One quid. Uh, what does money. it mean though? Hello. One pound. Yeah. One pound, half a baht. Because he'll go, he loves football, so we're gonna find like a uh, football uniform for him. In Tesco Lotus, they'll be three to four times the price, probably like four times the price in Tesco Lotus than they are here. And again, you know, on this channel, we're always preaching buy local because it's these local people here that travel from one place to another, one market to another in this in this van. They go as a family usually. Somebody sat in there playing form. They travel together from one market to another selling this stuff. This is how they make the livelihood. This is our, our, another reason to shop this way. Daniel's getting, the, you know, these sizes here and they're giant for Hugo. This is like eight year old. Yeah, it is. I gotta believe her, she said. It goes fast. I'm gonna get something for Yai too. Also cheap clothes. These are for the old old ties, old Thai ladies. It's the kind of stuff that they like. So I'll get a couple of those for Yai. And they always have like cheap shoes, cheap sandals. I watched this channel on YouTube called Indie Radio and it basically walks around different cities all over the world and plays indie music. Sometimes I just have it on in the background. But I love to watch it because every day there's a different location where he's just walking around Tokyo or he's walking around New York or he's walking around somewhere in Ireland and you just kind of see people living their lives. It just reminds me that there's a big wide world out there. Sometimes I'm just on the farm in our own little world and every day kind of bleeds into another. It's like Groundhog Day. And I love to watch it because it just gives me that window to the world and all these other people, you know, like people watching. They're living all these different in lives, interesting lives. They're dealing with their own little problems. Some of them look stressed. Some of them are chain smoking cigarettes. Some of them just chilled out, you know. There's different people all over the world. So I find it quite mind expanding to kind of have it on the big screen, um, just in the background. I was watching the one on New York earlier today and I walked past and it said, three t-shirts and i mean these t-shirts were just like plain white t-shirts for 60 dollars and this was just before we were coming here to the market and it made me laugh because i'm like three t-shirts for 60 dollars i mean here it'd be three t-shirts for three dollars or five dollars something like that and it just made me think that you're not actually paying for the t-shirt are you you're paying for the rent, you're paying for the location. Like that, that person is paying a rent in central New York and they've got to cover all those overheads. So they've got to charge $20 a t-shirt for a very plain, I'm talking like really basic plain, white like this t-shirt. Just funny, funny how things are so different here in Thailand. Yeah, I think they're nice. Get one of those. I think they look nice on her. What do you think guys? Put them on again. Yeah, they're nice for around the house. Get those ones too. Chai. And you guarantee wherever you go, body cap, do. Hey! Chihuahua. Man got me, huh? Man how, Chihuahua. Hey! 
no, 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 no. Uy. <laughs> sing, sing, dang, tea barn, mate. No. <laughs> I just said, is it loud at your house? Because I wanted Chihuahua once because they can sit in the room with you, you know what I mean? And they're just too yappy, though, too yappy. <laughs> yeah. Yap, 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 yap. Like me, yeah. <laughs> See? See? I am the yappy one. I'm the talky one. You might have noticed on these channels. I can talk, talk, talk. I do 20 minute vlogs, but sometimes I can talk for about 40, 50 minutes. <laughs> no problem. Uh, but then the rest of the day, the rest of my time when I'm not on camera, I hardly say a word really. When I'm with Damo, I moan a little bit, but I'd say about 80% of the day, I'm completely quiet. Lottery! And I talk, Naham. And I chana. And I'm an anchanalo. Kabogwani chanana. Tama chanala don't get ma. I'm going to turn. So 220 baht, she says, this is the winner. I said, if he doesn't win, we'll be back to get the money back. To be fair, it just occurred to me that she probably hears that joke about 50 times a day. Which one's the winner? But I bet she only heard it from one farang, so that's all right. Here we, we have a little antique, an old junk. Antiques and old junk store. Old junk. <laughs> old junk's the best way I can describe it. Damo says, not old junk, it's vintage. Vintage. Oh, I say, vintage. 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 This is a little kid here selling his cars. Lot need that, I can't. Pass it back. We do. We get one for Tis because I just like that this little boy is doing his his business here. Lang yai tarai, eh? Samurai has it. Let's get one for Tis because he's doing a good business here. Right, we'll get this one for Tis. This young man is doing his own little business. And I'm always trying to inspire Tis to sell cars and, and sell things online and do his own business and things. He does now already. Okay. <laughs> this is your fresh honey. Sami by Ana. And you have some nice gong here. Any man tie like that, guy. So it's 120 for this one, and hello, what and 100 for this. So it's very cheap. How about some stinky jewelry, in, babe? Just don't kiss me after. <laughs> it's the stinkiest, stinkiest fruit ever. Why it's so expensive now? Oh, 500 baht, 180 baht per kilo. We get we get some donuts here for. Otis, definitely get some of these for him. Okay, how any song, huh? Any song, do I? Like you, you don't look like then. Chai, I give my die. Any nung, huh? P tam tam eng, huh? Tam eng, huh? Tam tam ti ban, huh? Hi, huh? Oi, yak, huh? Yak, huh? Don't chai well and an, huh? Hi, huh? Hi, huh? Kung wan, huh? Kung wan, tam, huh? แต่ถ้าไม่ใครหมดคุณจะกินเองมั้ยเอ่อถ้าถ้าไม่หมดก็ให้คนอื่นให้เพื่อนให้ครับผมใครชัดนะครับครับผมขอขอบคุณครับคร
Just anything, guys. Just imagine anything that you would need. Bloody, raw blood, liver. That's what he likes, isn't it, babe? So any, inside, anything inside. you possibly would never eat in a million years, your dad would love that, wouldn't he? Yeah. Many, many Isan people will be happy. Snake heads, people. frogs. Once he ate a frog and it was a poisonous frog, nearly killed him, didn't he? Oh, no, yeah. I remember he had to go to the hospital because he was having pad kapow frog and he ate, he ate a bad flock frog. This is something that I'll always get when we're here on the market is cow mungai. So we have our cow rice mungai. This is with chicken on top. This is your normal cow mungai here. And then you have the fried cow mungai here. And um, it's very cheap the way. And how I happen in it? Samsit baht. So 30 baht each. And it comes with a little soup and some sauce you can put on top. Ao sam chin hap. Sam ho. Sam ho. I got my class. Sam check up. I got my classifier wrong there. I said Sam and and it's Sam Ho. The classifier is important which one you use. I think you can use and though, right? You will be understood if you use an. Sam and you, know? you can you can use that, but the correct one is ho when you're classifying what it is, the number of what you want. For example, eggs would be Sam Fall. For eggs, Sam Fall. And then for animals, for pigs it would be like Sam Door. Sam Door. These are classifiers that you need to that you need to use. You want that Coca-Cola? Little cheeky. How I know? Because I've lived here a long time. So these are the classifiers. I call them classifiers. I'm not sure if in English if that's the actual word, but that's what I use. Darwin's getting some meat for her mother. In the village, she says it's expensive in the village, so it's cheaper here on the market. Are we your fan going here to stop the flies coming along? Always a great selection of fresh fruit. So we get fruit from the kids here. And who could forget the fish? I think these are great, we'll get some big ones. Can I do it? Roy is it back to me? So, as you saw for the fish there, I say song doa, song doa, two song doa, two pieces. That's the classifier for fish or animals. For people, it's kun, song kun. Um, as I've said, Eggs, song fong. For sticks, song mai. Um, these are important to learn. You can just get away actually with saying like song an. Everybody will understand no matter what you're talking about, you say song an, they understand. So, this would be, I think, this one I'm not sure if you'd call this, you'd say nung mai sam fong. Any nung mai kai sam fong la? Nung mai, so one word, kai sam fong. Kai sam fong, nung mai. La. Ah, uh, sure, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sometimes I, I teach you things on this channel that I haven't confirmed. And I'm not perfect, by the way. My, my Thai is not perfect. I'm not one of those vloggers that speaks perfect Thai by any capacity, but I'll share what I know. Be careful. To see your dried, your dried fish lady. Nice dry fishy and actually smells very nice, I have to say. Doesn't smell bad at all. It's a lively old market today. We've actually come a little bit early because I try to beat the crowds. And finally for this market, Damo's buying some stuff for the kids. This is all homemade stuff, delicious Thai food. What have we got here, babe? Thai palo. It's like the taste. Any paneng, lot? Paneng palo. Paneng more, do I? Some pom chai. I'll have a Penang more. Lao cow do it. So that's it guys for this market. We're gonna head on home now.
Chao Chao Gui in Thai and in English is, uh, it's like black jelly you can see here inside it looks like this with the eyes like jelly and the top up with brown sugar so in a hot day like this it's good it's a hot day like this it's good uh, to have something like this to our house because he just drove around the village and sell shao gui one one cup 10 baht or 20 baht is big cup Amma, let's look Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.